feel the chemicals burn in my bloodstream. So tell me when it kicks in. Good morning and welcome back. Hey, we've got some great advice for those of you that have been hitting the gym lately or maybe you kind of want to get into working out. Kusha is here this morning. He just opened a cryotherapy spa on Bankers Hill. Mm -hmm. It's called Cryo Spa. This is the latest and greatest. I work out at a gym and I see they bring the mobile one to us, I think like once a month. Mm -hmm. Explain what it is and how it works. Yeah, so basically the machine takes liquid nitrogen and it cools the body down to about negative 200 degrees. Uh -huh. And uh, yeah, it's a three minute <laughs> wow. session. Yeah, it's cold. That's a uh, long three minutes. <laughs> it's a long three minutes, uh, but it basically gets a lot of the same benefits as like a 20 minute ice bath, mm -hmm. which I think would be more painful to sit in, um, in three really? minutes. So what does it feel like for the three minutes you're in there? It feels like really, really cold weather. It feels like you're standing out in like Naked zero and, like, degrees. Let's be yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. That's what it feels like pretty much. Uh, but it's not that bad because it's dry. It actually feels somewhat comfortable, I think. And used for faster recovery for from pain and from just working out those those muscles. Exactly. A lot of people like to use it for pain relief, recovery, anti-aging, metabolism boost. You name it. Perfect. And when you're in this 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 bath. Your head is out, but everything mm -hmm. else is in. That's right. Your head's sticking out of the right. machine, uh, but your whole body is in the machine. You have some great exercises you're going to show us today, things we can do at home. You don't have to go far to work out. I know I have kids at home. I can't always make it to the gym. Mm -hmm. And some great tips on how to get the same results using lighter weights. Exactly, right? yeah. Okay, so let's talk about it. What do you have? This is my favorite hack. It's called BFR training, also known as occlusion training. So mm -hmm. what you're doing is you're basically slowing blood flow by wearing wraps around the arms. Mm -hmm. And now what people can use, you know, if you have knee wraps at home, you could use those. If you have a medical tourniquet at home, you could use those. But, you know, basically what you do is you put the wrap around the upper arm or upper leg and you just tighten it, not to cut off blood flow, but tighten it to like on a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being tightest, a level 7. And what you're doing is you're basically only slowing the venous blood flow. So the veins are what take the blood out of the limb. Mm -hmm. You're slowing that process. And what it does is it tricks the brain into making you think that you're lifting heavy weight. Oh, okay. So, so you're getting the same, similar results to lifting heavy weight in the gym, but you're lifting body weight or light weight. Kusha, could you use this while you're lifting as well? Have you ever seen that before? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, so that's actually what, that's you're, what you're doing. To do. That's what you're oh, doing, okay, yeah. Okay, so, okay, okay. Will so. my bicep pop out like yours if I put that on? That actually could, yeah, it really, pretty quickly. Does it make them appear larger than they really are, Kusha? <laughs> yeah, Because I'll go to the gym with them all day long. All right, so what kind of exercises? Oh, something else you can use. Yeah, so this is my product called the BFR Bands. Mm -hmm. um, basically, I just made it easier because sometimes the medical tourniquets are flimsy. They pop right. off. They're, these are actually designed for cutting off blood flow, which is not what you want to do. Knee wraps are almost impossible to put on your arms by yourself. So I made something simpler with the proper width and proper tension that you could just put on and close, and that's it. So if you use it for your arms, you place it there. Yep. If you're going to do legs, can you also use it on your legs? Yeah, top Same of the legs. Top Same of yep. the leg. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Even if you're doing calves, all that, you just keep it right at the yeah. top. Yeah, you could technically move it a little bit lower if you really want to focus on calves, but mm -hmm. you would still put it top of the limbs. Can you wrap it around your waist and get your abs going? You <laughs> actually, quicker? yeah. I was going to ask you, could you do your chest? Yeah, so the thing about it is it has what's called a systemic effect. So when you wear it on the upper arms, mm -hmm. it actually not only helps develop the biceps, triceps, and, and the arms and shoulders, but also the, uh, the pecs your and pants. chest, your back. If you're doing it on legs, it will help the core a little bit in the abs. So it does have uh, an effect that's farther than just the muscles that you're occluding. What are some easy exercises we can do at home? I know you can grab some household products and get a great workout. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, if you want, I can show you something sure. you can do. So yeah. if you want, let's okay. put this on your arm here. Let's see if my bicep looks as big as his, Phil. This is a good looks better. Me. Does it look huge? How does that feel? Is that comfortable? <laughs> yeah. Cool. And then we'll put Dr. this one on the other arm. Okay. She's ready. I'm ready. That's it. And then all you would do. I'm going to be huge the by key tomorrow. with this, if you want to just step, step on, on that. It. Yeah. Step on that there. Yeah. And the key is you want to use very lightweight. So you're supposed to use basically like 20% of what, whatever you can do for one repetition maximally. So okay. it's, the idea is very, very light. You don't want to go heavy. A lot of times people will just use body weight, which is fine too. The key is to do a lot of reps. So you're supposed to train to fatigue. Do as many as you can do, then rest for about 15, 20 seconds, and then repeat. And you want to do a lot of sets, at least four sets up to maybe 10 sets. And the workouts total should be short, maybe 15 minutes total. So the nice thing about this is that, let's say you can't make it to the gym or maybe you're traveling, uh, you could do this anywhere. You could take an awesome. elastic band like this, you put these on, now you have your whole gym with you wherever you go. Kusha right. Kovandi, he is the creator of the BFR band. Do they Thank look bigger, so Phil? Much. Yeah, they look a lot bigger. Yeah. Thanks for joining us, buddy. I really appreciate it. <laughs> Thank yeah, you absolutely. so much. Thank you. Hey, still to come on CW6 News in the morning.